Hey, what's up everyone? Rogue Maverick here. Welcome to my next Let's Play of a Naughty Dog game. If you remember what I said at the end of the Sonic Mania Let's Play, that means I'm covering The Last of Us. This has been a phenomenal experience. No matter how many times I've played through it. The only problem I actually even had with it was the ending and it just, like if Without spoiling anything, it felt abrupt. That was it. That's all I'm going to say. You'll find out what I mean at the end of the playthrough. <laughs> Anyways, this game I have probably played through four or five, at least, like five or six at least times. Like at least half a dozen times. Maybe even seven or eight. This game, I've only owned it for like a year, almost a year now. Yet I think I've played it more times than Uncharted 3. Well, I mean, I played this game like three or four times in back-to-back -back when I first got it. Yeah. So, yeah, I... I, uh, I enjoy this game a lot. But I was kind of scared of points on the first playthrough. Because this is Naughty Dog's take on the Resident Evil type of genre. In fact, it kind of bit, plays. It reminded. After seeing Rev, bleh, Resident Evil Revelations 2, I thought, wow. Last of Us really does take notes from, from uh, Resident Evil. I mean, you know, now that I, got it, now that I think about it, I should really see if I can try and get back into. Try and try to. Resident Evil 4. Again. Yeah. Okay, so I'm just gonna cut ahead because this is gonna take a bit of a long load. And there we go, the game's pretty much fully loaded now. Listen to me. He is the contractor. He is the contractor, okay? I can't lose this job. I, I understand. Let, let's talk about this in the morning, okay? We'll talk about it in the morning. All right, good night. Hey. Scoot. I'm late work, huh? What are you still doing up? It's late. Good. What time is it? It's way past your bedtime. I can still today. Honey, please not right now. I do not have the energy for this. Here. What's this? Your birthday? You kept complaining about your broken watch. So, uh, figured, you know. You like it? Mm -hmm. Honey, this is... It's what? nice, but I... I think it's stuck. It's not. What? No, 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 no. Oh, ha, ha. Where did you get the money for this? Drugs. I sell hardcore drugs. Oh, good. You started helping out with the mortgage then. Yeah, you wish. So that was Joel, and the, the girl here is Sarah. So what's Hello? a part of The Sarah. Last of Us? Honey, I need to get your daddy on the phone. Uncle Tommy, what, what time is it? I need to talk to your dad now. Uh, Uncle Tommy? Hello? So now we take control of Sarah. What was that all about? Uh-oh. 
just got to real I realized something. Oh wait, no, no, control the game. Controls. There, that feels better. So she has a lot of CDs and it looks like she even has ways to play tape. So if we go over here. Oh, dang it. I forgot to give this to him. This is, this is cute. You're not a fossil yet. Happy birthday. And it basically says, Dear Dad, let's see. You're never around. You hate the music I'm into. You practically despise the movies I like. And yet, somehow, you still manage to be the best dad every year. How do you do that? Happy birthday, Pops. Love, Sarah. That was so sweet, I have to admit. So, yeah. Anyways, let's continue going out. I gotta admit, this Dad? kind of terrified. Well, not terrified, but it unsettled me, which I think was the intention. So, as for the plot, well, we're gonna find out in this video. Minutes spike, a minute spikes at area hospitals. 300% increase due to mysterious infection. What on earth? Is that the TV? Daddy? Let's go in here. Are you in here? Seems to be somehow connected to the nation. Where the heck Africa. are you? We've received reports that victims afflicted with the infection show signs of increased aggression. And here, now. Hey, there well, seems to be some commotion out. coming from the... Get the hell out of here, <laughs> uh. <laughs> Oh crap, that was close. Continue to go downstairs. What is going on? What the? Police cars. Let's see, if you remember at the cutscene, it said eleven uh, eleven fifty. Now it's two fifteen. It's only been a few hours. What? There's this phone. Eight missed calls. Where the hell are you? Call me on my way. Which, I think that's actually an Android phone. Oh. There's a note over here. I'm gonna be home late tonight. Go ahead and order food. See you in the morning, Dad. Where is he? This is just a perfect opening for this game. What the hell happened to the dog? Let's go in here. Here you are. Sarah, are you okay? Yeah. Does anyone come in here? No, who would come in here? Don't go near the door. Just, just stand back there. Dad, you're kind of freaking me out. What's going on? It's the Coopers. So many ride with them. I think they're sick. I'm kind of sick. <laughs> Jimmy! Dad? Come here. Come here. Jimmy! Jimmy, you stay back! Jimmy, I am warning you. Oh Don't! They've been lost their minds. Can we just please go? Some sort of parasite or something. You gonna tell me what happened? Later. Hey, sir. How you holding up, honey? I'm fine. Can we hear us on the radio? Yeah, sure thing. Thanks. 
cell phone, no radio. Yeah, we're doing great. A minute ago, newsman wouldn't shut up. They say, where to go? They said, uh, armies put up roadblocks on the highway. No getting into Travis County. We need to get the hell out. Take 71. 71, that's where I'm at. Did they say how many are dead? Probably a lot. They found this one family all mangled inside their Thomas. house. Right. I'm sorry. Oh, the parasite. So, this is kind of confusing. Jesus Christ, how did this happen? They got no clue. But we ain't the only town. At first they were saying it's just the south. Now they're going on about the east coast and west coast. Holy hell. That's Lewis's farm. I hope that son of a bitch made it out. I'm sure he did. That's crazy. Are we sick? No, of course not. How do you know? They said it's just uh, people in the city. We're good. Didn't Jimmy work in the city? That's right, he did. We're fine. Let's see what they need. What the hell do you think you're doing? Keep driving. They got a kid, Joel. So do we. Well, we have room. Hey! Keep hey, driving, stop! Tony. Stop! You can see what I see. Someone else will come along. Should have helped him. So there's the hospital and another ambulance. They've been working overtime, I imagine, with the, what we saw. Oh, this is bad. Everyone and their mother had the same damn idea. We could just backtrack and. Hey, what the fuck, man? Let's go! Oh, Shit. Oh, my God. What the fuck just happened? Did you see that? That was crazy. Where is he running from? Get us out of here. I'll try it. Oh, we can't stop here, Tom. I can't fucking drive through. Get back up there. They're behind me, too. There, there. Hold on. Go. So now we're taking control of Joel, who will actually be controlling for a little while as well. Whoa, hello! So this game was released in 2013, by the way. Same year, I think, the PS4 and Xbox One came out. So now we're basically running. This is basically sort of the end of the world sort of thing going on. Whoa. Alright, so we're just gonna keep going. And it's gonna be... Oh, 
crazy. The number of confirmed deaths has passed 200. The governor has called a state of emergency. There are hundreds and hundreds of bodies lying in the streets. Panic spread worldwide after a leaked report from the World Health Organization showed that the latest vaccination tests have failed. With the bureaucrats out of power, we can finally take the necessary steps. Los Angeles is now the latest city to be placed under martial law. All residents are required to report to their designated foreign Riots have continued for a third consecutive day, and winter rations are at an all-time low. The group calling themselves the Fireflies have claimed responsibility for both attacks. Their public charter calls for the return of all branches of government. Demonstrations broke out following the execution of six more alleged Fireflies. Remember when you're lost in the darkness? Look for the light. Believe in the fireflies. Coming. How was your morning? No, I don't. Well, I have some interesting news for you. Where were you, Tess? West End District. Hey, we had a drop to make. We. We had a drop to make. Well, you wanted to be left alone, remember? 
So I'll take one guess. The uh, old deal went south and the client made off with our pills. Is that about <laughs> right? The deal went off without a hitch. Enough ration cards to last us a couple of months. Easy. You want to explain this? I was on my way back here and I got jumped by these two assholes, all right? And yeah, they got a few good hits in, but... Look, I managed. These assholes still with us? Well, that's funny. Let's find out who they were. Yeah, look, they were a couple of nobodies. They don't matter. What matters is that Robert fucking sent them. Our Robert. He knows that we're after him. He figures he's gonna get us first. Son of a bitch, he's smart. No. He's not smart enough. warehouse in area five can't say for how long though well i'm ready now yeah oh i can do now so i'll i'll continue to explain now now that we've seen what exactly happened so the and the, uh, back in that t 20 years ago in actually 2013 this takes place in the year 2033 now um but in 2013, an infection called the cordyceps virus uh, basically control, uh, started infecting people. Normally it doesn't actually affect people. It's only like, like little insects. But this is a mutated strain of the cordyceps fungus, which takes control of the host and kills it and makes it do things against its will. And, well, as you can see, that sort of thing caused the end of the world, basically. We're now in a pretty much post-apocalyptic world. So what's cool is that this is showing some of the aftermath. I like the last playthrough I did. I actually decided to stay around and watch some of this stuff happen. world. So apparently this fungus has wiped out 60% of the world's population. So basically the world population is about 7.5 billion. That basically means there's like 3 to 4 billion people left in the world now. Print. It can actually be very handy. So yeah, this video is going to be a bit of a longer video because I want to show off. 
I want to show off the, more of the gameplay. It's the debut episode, so why not? So you press and hold R1, and Jesus is slow. We're going to close all the checkpoints. We're going to have to go around the outside. Outside the wall. Or we could just let Robert go. <laughs> Cute. Hey, Tess, you see that shit? I was there. Hey, how's the East Tunnel looking? Yeah, it's clear. I just used it. No patrols. So where are you off to? Gonna pay Robert a visit. <laughs> you too? Who else is looking for him? Marlene. Hang on, I'm gonna, since this game can get downright dark at times, that yeah, looks better. Around, to find him. Marlene? What are the fireflies named with Robert? <laughs> I think she'd tell me. Well, what did you tell her? The truth. I got no idea where he's hiding. Good man. Hey, you stay out of trouble, all right? Military's gonna be out in force soon. Yeah, see you around. So, yeah, the game does start yeah, off a little dull problem. like this, but it's pro that. still a prologue. Like you better find him before the fireflies do. This is us. Hey, guys. How's it going? Shit's stirring up out there. How are we looking over here? Uh, it's been quiet. No signs of military are infected. That's what I like to hear. Joel, give me a hand with this. Sure thing. I doubt that TV still works. So a gas power generator. So you just this I think this runs similar to Uncharted in some ways with the vaulting and our backpacks are still here from last time. Alright, so now press the R1 button, like I said, while reloading. Right, me up. You can reload, I mean. We're not aiming. You ready? Yes, ma'am. <laughs> <sighs> now, it's not really explained how Tess and uh, Come on. Joel met. So basically, Joel got, um... Ain't been out here in a while. It's like we're on a date. Well, I am the romantic type. You got your ways. So, uh, Joel was be had become a hardened smuggler because, especially hardened... Where's the ladder? Well, it's gotta be around here somewhere. Because, you know, Sarah was killed, you know? But... Got it. Great, bring it over. I mean, something like that would, yeah. Tutorial not. Alright, yeah, I don't need to show off tutorials. So what you gotta do with this is simple. Bring it up over to here and then press the triangle button. Ladies first. <laughs> Lady, you must be thinking of someone else. <laughs> it's all really This way. But he still has his moments of humor, so Let's, head, let's check out here. So you can, cause this is another interesting thing. You can find different collectibles throughout the environment. And you can also see... Just basically... A sheet first. Oh. Oh, shoot first. Sorry. 
so you can see is people used to camp out here. Down through here. Be better. Look, once we get our merchandise back, it should be easy to unload. Well, speaking of merchandise, when's our next shipment due? Hold up. Spores. Because, and that's how. This is how people can get infected, outside from being bitten. Where the hell are all these coming from? The place was clear last time. They're coming out of something. Stay alert. So you press the circle to crouch. There's our culprit. Probably is not that old. Better keep your eyes and ears open. Hmm? Ah, uh, here we go. We should be able to fit through here. You okay? Yeah. Damn ceiling's falling apart. Be careful. This way. And so you just basically go through here. Easy. Watch it, watch it. So, actually, you know what? So that now that I've shown off some of the gameplay, this video is going long enough. So I will see you all in the uh, next episode, where we'll continue going through this kind of building, chasing Robert. See you all then.